That's my girlfriend, Candy, and I'm Brandon. Welcome to the channel. Today, Candy and I are going to go on about a three and a half mile hike, and it would be pretty rad if you would join us because we have a lot to explore. Uh, we're going down here to a small dried up, well mostly dried up, I don't want to call it a creek or a part of the river, and it ties back into the main part of the river over here. So we're going to walk down here and check this thing out. We've kayaked to this junction before in the river, but it looks like we can walk there. Well, there's trails mostly there. We might have to go off in the woods a little bit, but I think we're going to make it down there and uh we'll see what happens Found a little game trail here. Let me check this thing out. No telling who's home back here. Oh, it's more of those wait a minute bushes. Ouch. Oh, I bet somebody lives in there. What do y'all think lives in that hole? Are you home? Don't come running out at me. <laughs> I guess we lost that little trail. I think so. I think it was... But I see metal back here. Oh, look, it's another one of those death trees. Death tree. Look at this. There's some metal. Oh, wheelbarrow? There's a bucket? A trash can? It's got some... Looks like they got this one with shotgun. Yep. Old wheelbarrow. I actually think my dad has the same exact wheelbarrow. What's this? This. This is one of those machines you spread like seed or fertilizer on your yard. Like, uh. We're out here in the middle of nowhere, and this is head on this way, I guess. That's a little creek right there. Let's follow that creek. This has to go to where we're going. Ouch! I got a wait a minute bush got in my hand. Oh, there's a road. There's an old oh, road. Gosh, dang it. You tripped them. Now here's an old road. Cool beans. Oh, there's a person over there. There's a person. Oh, yeah. We waved at the person we know each other's here, so. Yeah, this is old asphalt. This was a road at one point in time, like a real road. We should look up some old maps yes. and try to figure out if this was an actual road or not. I hear ducks. Look the tree. The tree made the asphalt from the road pop up. Yeah. <laughs> That's pretty neat. So there's a pond back over here. I'm gonna try to get two, but there's a wait a minute bush. You see this one? Wait a minute, Bush. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. 
Oh, shoot, shoot. Oh, cool. Some ducks over here. Look how clear that water is. Oh, wow. <laughs> A little island right here. <laughs> I, should, I should set up on here and camp on that little island one night. If it had two trees, I totally would. I'd set my hammock up right there and camp. Water is crystal freaking clear. This is that road we were on. I got this one and I don't know. Did you? Yeah. Oh, look at this! Yeah, I got this. Oh, cow! <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, beaver coming here! Holy cow! That is a lot! A lot of wood they've removed. That's crazy. Look how clear that water is. All the way back there. Yeah, we're going to change directions that uh, the game trail turns into wait a minute bushes. There's an old fence post. Couple of bricks right there. Whoa. Go back up here and get on this little road. Oh, did you find a Christmas tree? Let me see your Christmas tree. Perfect. Yes. <laughs> That's a little mini Christmas tree. That's a little. <laughs> Texas, Texas State Highway Department, 1940. Whoa. 1940. Evalde Construction Company. So that means we got to go back, we got to go way back, we got to go back to the 30s. Oh, 1930s? Yeah, if they made changes out here in the 40s, we need to, I want to know what it looked like before and then immediately after. Yeah, this is the main main road. Huh. Well, I want to keep going that way. All right, that's fine. We'll follow this for a little ways. getting up here to there's a low water crossing and this is the little branch of the creek we want to traverse to where it ties into the main part of the creek hopefully this one is mostly dry all right so there's a bridge right there that's 377 that's north that south Roanoke's right down here we're gonna walk down this river creek whatever you want to call it as far as we can look for cool rocks there's all kinds of cool rocks maybe 
find an old fossil. This hillside, this hillside's been tore up by pigs. That little shelf that runs along through there is all recently tilled up. Pigs come through here and eat all those roots. I would almost swim in there. Oh, good thing we gotta make sure we don't slip and fall. Holy cow. I'm gonna go, go up. Hang on, I'm coming. I got it. <laughs> <laughs> Do burn out. Here we go. All right. Yeah, that's what I did not want to fall down. Looks like we can get back down up here. I'm gonna try to... I'm gonna go down right here. Cool, back down here. She found her way down. Here you go. Human beings have been everywhere. Look, there's rebar. That's concrete. Modelo! Modelo! Another beaver stick. Man, there's some more concrete. Look here. There is some history out here. We're going to have to figure this out because I want to know what went on back in the 40s when they built that little culvert thing back there. Look at that rock. Look at these grains that go. Found something over here on the bank. What do you reckon it is? <laughs> I don't know. What is it? Wow, that is old. That is old, old, old. Well, there's a square headed nut right there. Hmm. It looks like, like maybe a hatch cover or something. Maybe that. Don't know. But that's where it was. That's where it can stay. <laughs> okay. There's you a good stick. Gotta do some more work there. You sand that bad boy up. No, you're fine. There's another. <laughs> How do we get over there? I don't know. You have to I go back to go and back. around. around. It's well, probably worth. I'll do it. So this one's heavy. Okay. I don't need a better stick. Ugh. Oh, yeah. A lot lighter. Good stick right there. There you go. Yeah. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Thanks to the beavers. Uh, found a little shell. Look at that one. It's like perfect. Oh no, something got in there and ate it.
had to get up here out of the creek because it filled up with water. And so we had to get up here where we didn't get wet. Look at that. Look at this here, beaver. It looks like one, two, three, four, five, six, about six, six or ten little gnaws and took off a, I don't know, that's an inch around piece of wood. It's like little death spikes everywhere. If you fall, you die. The beavers, the beavers left death spikes everywhere. You fall, you fall on a death spike. There's one, there's one, and there, and there, and there. Just don't fall in the woods. What do you, what do you find? Oh, it is a turtle. It was a turtle. Old oh, turtle. Cool. And this shell. It doesn't even look that old either. How cool is that? Little guy. Huh. The creeks, the creeks over there. We're gonna get up here in the woods a little bit and walk. This doesn't seem like a spot humans have ever really been recently. A wolf -a ball <laughs> out here in Wait, nowhere. Oh, deer poo poo. Oh, it's fresh. Oh, yeah, that's fresh. That's fresh. Where is it at? Did it drop its antler? That's what I want to find his antler. Let's go this way. Oh, wait a minute. Bush up my feet. I would say this is a pretty cool area. All right, here's back over here in the creek. It's so nice looking. Oh, that's thick right there. We're gonna have to go. I'm gonna right through here. This looks pretty clear. Oh, shoot. Oh, there's ducks. I hope they don't hit their head on nothing. <laughs> Look at all the beaver sticks. It's made a trail of beaver sticks in the woods. What is it done? Oh, we scared the ducks off. That's the that flew off. It might be. Now, what in the world is going on here? Why? Why is there a trail of beaver sticks? There's beaver sticks over there. All right. There's some beaver sticks down there. But look right here. A whole, a whole line of beaver sticks. They literally just chew all the bark off these. Unless they're eating, do they eat the bark? I don't know. I do not understand why there's just a perfect line of beaver sticks out here. Like, nowhere else just a do 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 do. Maybe they get drunk, and that's how they find their way back. Maybe that's how they find their way back when they're out partying. Oh. <laughs> they leave the sticks. Yeah. I'm gonna go on down here to water level. How cool is this?
Do we want to cross? Walk on this side a little ways? Yeah, why not? It's the side we came from. Let me see how this... Yeah. I can come over there and you can hand me your stick and I'll pull on it. Oh, cool, a golf cart seat. Which one of y'all lost your golf cart seat? Someone. Oh, an arrow. Look. All right, so Candy, Candy just walked through here and she walked right by this arrow. I, I suspect someone shot this arrow up in the air maybe. And it landed here. I don't carry this arrow. That's carbon fiber. Oh, there's a Gatorade bottle. But I am interested in the golf cart seat. Which one of you folks lost your golf cart seat out here in the middle of freaking nowhere? Hmm? If you need a golf cart seat, Send me 20 bucks and I'll tell you where this one is. We're gonna follow, follow the little river creaky thing. We've crossed to the other side. We were over there. We crossed here. Some more beaver sticks. I'm taking us down a gully again. It's pretty steep. <laughs> seen something cool but I saw two something cools over here you'll see this big tree that's a big tree this tree look here look what the beavers did look what the beavers did the beavers chewed and chewed and chewed and chewed and chewed on there that is rad Oh, an asp. A little asp. I don't want to mess with those. This, this is the bark people would carve with. Um, they sell that by the pound. Look, the beavers got this tree. So, for those of y'all who don't realize, trees, trees take water up through what's called the sap wood, which is a little layer of wood on the outside protected by the bark. All the wood on the inside is like the hardwood, the heart of the tree, and it's not really alive anymore. So when a beaver comes through and chews all of the heartwood off of a tree, the tree dies. It's effectively just cutting off its lifeline because the, the juice is all going outside. The so beavers killed this big tree you can see the bark's gone. What, is that a tree? Yeah, that is. That's a smooth tree. That's Let's a go bright, check it out. There's your pallet. Oh, yeah. <laughs> There's another angry tree. Ooh, angry. 
making sure that I get it all out. I think I did. It might be still in there. Now that, that is a big old tree. Oh man, look at that. Here's one. Yep. That is a widow maker. That's the one I've seen. Chewed off by the beavers. This tree is falling over. And is right up there, stuck in that tree. Now we made it to where I wanted to go. This is this is Denton Creek. Here comes a guy on a boat. Y'all catching anything? Uh, yeah. After finishing the conversation with these fishermen, who weren't having any luck, they pretty well finished up our adventure for the day. We made it to our destination. We have a better sense now of where we are on the water. We found a lot of relics from the past. There's clearly a lot of history out here in this area. The old road. We found a few old home sites as well. It'd be interesting to really find out what went on back here in the 40s. Maybe we can do that one day. But until then, give us a like, subscribe. We'll be back with additional videos like this. Y'all gonna go try to hunt the alligator? Uh, now we're looking for hogs. Oh. There's an alligator down there. That's what we're trying to really? film them. Yeah. Alligator? Yeah, man. They were in the Eagle Mountain Lake, and I guess they reported them out here now, so we were trying to film them. Oh, wow. Yeah. Didn't see them, no, we didn't see anything. All right. <laughs>